Ah, because I was always headed this way. Portland protesters burned Bibles, American flags outside the federal courthouse. Again, all this is, this is why when they were trying to take down the Confederate flag, you say no. Again, a lot of um, less critical thinking people that I know, again, I have a, I grew up in a certain area and I have a lot of black friends. You know, every perceived slight against the, okay, so that's wrong, every failure of the black community Again, this is just this is just all me talking to, to to friends I know, black friends, right? So, but I believe it it basically gives an insight on a lot of these um uh, BLM protesters, right? Well, these are just Antifa, full of white people. Anyway, the the point is, right? If a similar to like a woman, if 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 a woman fails, it's someone else's fault, right? So if a black person fails, they'll try to find a scapegoat. So the reason blacks don't succeed is because there's a confederate flag. Okay, Nobody notices the confederate flag unless you point it out, right? Nobody notices the American flag unless you point it out. Okay? People just put their head down and just keep walking. Okay? These aren't good people. Okay? But it will always lead to this, right? This is what the West is built on. People will say it's built on uh, Roman, uh, Roman and Greek philosophy and values which is true but this is the key to the west this year Christianity okay when you defeat religion you end up with the uh, anarchy okay don't be surprised if the, if, if, this, if if Portland evolves or devolves into um, escape from LA escape from New York you know what movie is really good was the Book of Eli. That deserves a lot of credit for getting a lot of things right. Anyway, um, let's continue. Radical activists, white leftists, sorry, in Portland, Oregon, burned Bibles and the American flag in front of a federal courthouse this weekend. Oh, great. Wonderful. Co in news, Cohen, Co K O I N, I guess, I don't know, reported that Friday protests started out as peaceful Assemb again the way Antifa works the way the communists this come okay the first wave will be the protesters the second wave will be the people who agitate the third wave will be the violence and as others have said the in the in the daytime it's a protest in the night that's when the violence and agitators come okay Twitter user Ian Miles Chong shared a video demonstrating the desecrating the Bibles and the symbol of American freedom. Okay, this is a here. You know, I've seen people talk about like why don't conservatives don't don't do anything. I have a couple of theories. Conservatives they're not like these people okay they believe in the law of the land all right they, they okay the number one thing to conservatives yes but it's also family right they don't want to see the family hurt how do conservatives quote unquote or people on the right handle things voting voting what happens when conservatives strike back they get arrested they get called bigots for disagreeing with homosexuality okay anytime I hear these people it's just like what are you talking about you know you, you believe the exact things that get conservatives deplatformed because they disagree with homosexuality which most people disagree with they tend to go along with it because it's the um, societal quote unquote trend or they're afraid to be attacked by the uh, media or lose their jobs. That's it. Sorry. Again, a, a big, a big sign that the nation was falling, or nations in a in a free fall is again when you have military base, uh, bases putting up LGBT rainbow flags. Yes, these are the signs. Okay, when you put a BLM flag next to American flag, you. You, you're putting a communist symbol. That says a lot. 
in the later thread Chong wrote um, I don't know what burning the Bible has to do with uh, protesting against police brutality do not be under the illusion that these protests and riots are anything but an attempt to dismantle all of it. Yeah, okay, right. So we got this here. We know what's going on. You know, I, I truly believe only time will tell when these big liberal strongholds will flip. Okay? It will flip. Okay? People aren't that brain dead. Okay? It will flip. Be it New York, California, Oregon. One of these big liberal strongholds will flip okay it takes a few million but it's very doable okay news reporter Danny Pearson posted a video of them burning American flag and I can't stand this stuff man just like what are you doing like again they should leave if they do this stuff leave again this is a sign of a divided nation okay I wouldn't even say divided, right? The proper word is indoctrinated certain people. Again, you can tell who's indoctrinated. Most of the problems come from the coastal cities, the coastal democratic-run cities, the coastal cities that has a certain percentage of um, uh, a certain 13% of the nation, okay? They have the highest 13% of the nation we get my drift, okay? Okay, they have the ghettos. Okay, they have the violence. There's a, sometimes, you know, one of the disagreements I have is about correlation. You know, it's like sometimes correlation does, and oftentimes it does equal causation. Or you know, it's 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 yeah, it's kind of like a repeat event in science. You know, if something has to be repeated, but sometimes, say, something happens just once and you can't repeat again. It happens. It happens. Anyway, um, uh, Portland, Valley Lens, blah, blah, blah. Gosh almighty. All right, we got this here. This is just, this is from CBN News. Uh, I'm guessing it's Christian something. A Christian perspective. All right, so these people are more believable than anything CNN, MSNBC has. Okay, these people are more credible than the New York Times. Okay, and it's a hundred percent truth. There's no lying what I'm saying. <laughs> this was by Andrea Morris. Again, this is uh, CBN News. Dot com. I'm not too. Um, I'm not too. Um, I, I don't really visit them, no idea. It just popped up in one of my feeds. Here we are. Anyway, share, save, subscribe, thumbs up again. A sign, right? And uh, it, for those who are wondering, it seems people on the right, conservatives, they simply will vote rather than um, do these tactics. These are tactics of the. I won't say terrible people. I I know they're communists, but these are these are tactics of the unintelligent. Okay. The first thing that they do after they shoot one another is call the police, but then they realize they defunded the police. Share, safe, subscribe, thumbs up, hope you enjoyed. Again, I'm on Parler, Gab, Twitter, yada yada under the same name. I do nothing but the S H I T posts. As uh, I, I try to live a life outside of social media. <laughs> Bye.